How can a player be known as a defensive star while also putting up the worst defensive run saved out of any position in the MLB? And why are people upset that he doesn't have a gold glove when his career defensive run saved is actually negative 14? So I actually asked my Instagram followers what they thought of said player and this is what they said. In the end, it was all, he's a great fielder, but he sucks at hitting. What I don't think people realize is he's actually a career 280 hitter and he's literally hitting 308 right now. That's actually like pretty dang good. But who the heck are we even talking about? Let me just show you. That is falling into left center. We're actually gonna be breaking down why Jose Iglesias is just so unique and specifically look at his glove because he's like a magician. The stuff he does is insane. I'm actually holding the glove that was made for Jose Iglesias, but then he signed with Rawlings, so Mizuno just never sent it to him. And now I have it for some reason. We're actually gonna look at how he wears and breaks in his glove, and then we're gonna take some ground balls to see how we like it ourselves. Obviously, he's made some super impressive plays, but he's gotta be struggling somewhere because his defensive stats should look much, much better. It seems that he's actually really consistent and often elite when the ball is straight in front of him or to his left. But that means that his weak spot is actually his right side. All these red dots are actually missed plays and they're much heavier on the left side of the field which for Jose, that's gonna be his backhand. Now this all could be because of his glove, like messing up the initial pickup or having a bad transfer, but he's so good with his glove that I'm gonna guess no. Most likely it's just because he has a weaker arm. It is insane how much one weakness can affect your entire game. He would be an elite shortstop if he could solve this one problem. Cause don't forget, the dude's hitting 308 right now. It's weird how when somebody's sort of a small shortstop good with his glove, you kind of just assume like, oh, he's probably not a very good hitter. That's how a lot of bad high school coaches are. They just assume if you're short, you're fast. You're gonna hit lead off. I have to say the most interesting part of Iglesias' game is his glove flips. Jose Iglesias uses his glove more than anyone in the MLB, and honestly, it's really unnecessary sometimes, but it works. Like this moment, for example, he just chooses to use a glove flip rather than just tossing the ball to somebody. He hands down has more glove control than any other active player, and I think part of it is how he breaks in his glove. He wears the glove traditional with his finger in and usually has a batting glove underneath as well. He closes the glove thumb to middle finger. He flares the thumb but keeps the pinky straight. His fingers and web are very loose and clearly likes the glove to be very, very worn. In. Ideally, we'll be able to feel the ball more and have better glove control. So better glove flips, quick or transfers, that's the idea. One thing I can guarantee is that this glove feels absolutely great so far. Quick note, this glove is definitely not broken in 100% like he does it. Now he shaped the glove like it, but he really puts a ton, a ton, a ton of work into his gloves. That just takes time, I wasn't able to do that. I've had a couple now where I've kind of botched it off the pinky on a backhand, um, which was kind of funny because he's not very good at backhand. Also, side note, you guys, he's an MLB player. He's fantastic. He's extremely talented. I'm saying in comparison. I'm nothing compared to him. Let's make that clear. But messing up backhands, and I think it's just because of the break in of the glove, having all four fingers in feels very unnatural. There's two things I've noticed about him, and it's actually that he likes to spin a lot when he throws, and he plays to his left, he'll boom. And the other thing is that he makes his plays very quickly. Rather than fielding a ball, kind of coming together and throwing, almost all of his plays seem to just be like bang, bang. And if it's true that he doesn't have a very good arm, that would kind of make sense. Just get rid of the ball very quickly. <laughs> That one's probably like right on camera. Obviously I'm the one messing up, but it's always hitting the same spot of the pinky. It's just kind of interesting. Every baseball player should know, especially infielders, 
when you just nail the front of your finger and it just starts gushing, bleh, I hate that. I'm gonna show you guys where he catches the ball in his pocket. Here we go. So we know he breaks the glove in thumb to middle finger and that ball just likes to sink back, back here. So basically rather than it being on the index finger and the web, it's mostly only in the web. I will say compared to a lot of gloves, the transfers do feel really, really good. Very open glove. As we already know, he's insanely good with glove flips. When it comes to glove flips, you can kind of just like force the ball out. You just stop your glove and the ball will continue. It just kind of looks like that. But a good glove flip is gonna kind of whip out of it. So it kind of starts back here and it just comes along the fingers. It's a whip action and he is so good at it. It's crazy. All right, don't tell anybody about that. If you're watching that, I sort of cock back and then try to go. You just kind of lose all momentum. If you're gonna do it, it's gotta be like, boom. Just like catch, flip. Okay, that was a much better example though. All right, I'm gonna get like a forehand glove flip. <laughs> Ow! One thing I noticed was that even on like routine slow rollers, he will pick it up and it just snaps into his hand. Like his transfers are just so fast. Little chopper, gonna have to hurry on the charge, Iggy. Quick throw, in time, nice play. Even he watching plays. on like routine plays, you can tell he has a ton of glove control. By the way, you should go watch this video.